D's up fishing beginning of the video. I'm here with Jason, one of my uh, comrades with PG&E. Uh, this is my first time kayaking, guys, so I'm gonna give it a shot. I'll come back to you if I catch any fish. All right, guys, I'm out here and trying to get used to this kayak. Um, I adjusted the pedals already. Do you recommend like having a, a little band like this or? I, I, I like a little band. Okay. So you kind of just want to drag this slow and, and it, it's okay also to leave it in place and just shake it. Okay. Yeah. The fish will tell us how they want it. I'm going to try that little spot in there. Because the bank fishermen don't catch that area. This is a workout. Alright guys, I've been kayaking for a little bit, kind of get used to this kayak. Been in the water for about five minutes now. Beautiful day out here. Jason! 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 Got my first bass on my on the canoe. Really excited about this. Nice. Guys. Look at that beauty. Um, I'm gonna string it just to show the buddies and then I'll let it go. Nice, nice bass. Alright guys, so I'm about a, about an hour and a half into my kayaking trip. And it's a tough bite out here. I haven't fished in this pond for three years. Um, ever since I got my boat, I haven't been pond fishing. Uh, it's probably a pressured pond because a lot of people come during the weekend. So tough bite right now the bites off the bank right now using a uh, crawdad colored worm and I've got a bite on this I've also got a bite on this other worm it's like a purple looking worm so these are the two worms that I'm getting bites on so that's probably the two that I'm gonna stick with the rest of the day unless I uh, the bite completely stops then uh, I'll look for a different color um, I've thrown this chartreuse type color. Haven't got a bite on that. Um, I'll try a green green worm right now. I'm gonna stick to drop shot. I only have one stick, so I'm just gonna switch worms up. Um, it's the only thing I'm gonna switch. I'll come back to you if I get another fish. So on this lake, I'm just working the bank. Um, this, I'm sorry, this pond. I'm just working the bank, and this pond is probably no deeper than 10 feet at its deepest point. Um, I don't have a fish finder so I don't know the depth but I've, I've you know gauged it based off the locations I've been there could be deeper spots within this pond but so far it's on average it's about uh, five feet deep so anywhere you could you could throw this bait anywhere in the water and you should be able to catch I'm sticking to the banks because it's you know it's spawning season so there might be fish that are you know spawning or whatnot so that's why I'm sticking to the bank uh, once in a while I will throw out to the main body of water in the middle and see if I can get something but for the most part it's, it's just sticking to the bank I'm fishing slow I, I feel like I need to fish a little faster um, to cover more ground because I feel like it's more about putting the bait in front of them rather than them waiting for them to come to it bass Number two on the yak. Yeah. 
This is for Brandon. So throw it on the other side of that that branch and all that stuff and just hang it out right there. Yeah, next time get a, try a little closer to the bank, but right there in the same area. But Brandon's doing a great job as Captain Skipper. Should I call you Skipper now, Brandon? That's a big responsibility to be a skipper like this, you know? You're going to be able to tell everybody at school that you, you were driving a boat, a canoe. So you got to pay attention now. So like once you throw it, I, I always look at my, my line. So I'll throw it, look at my line, and if it's loose, then put your finger here just to help it so it doesn't uh, get tangled up. But just always keep an eye on that because, yeah, if you're not looking out for that, it will. Brandon's the skipper of the canoe, of the bass chaser. That's the name of the canoe. And Brandon's a rebel. He doesn't have his hat on or nothing. I don't know if Pat's going to approve of this, sure. You don't have... Hey. He's gonna, I bet you he loves it because he's the captain right now. Try to throw in the middle of that little area and just let it hang out there and you'll, you'll grab one right there. Just not, don't try to take out your son. That was a good throw, considering your son was there. It's a big one, guys. Check it out! Right. Guys. I don't know, I'm gonna weigh her. I just got myself a lunker. So I'm gonna weigh her. We're at zero right now. See what she weighs. Okay. Zero. Four pound two ounces, guys. Four pounder. What a, what a great fight on the kayak, guys. What a monster. I'm going to put her back in the water. Alright, guys. We're getting ready to call it a day. 
had fun, had fun fishing on this kayak. Uh, first time I've ever fished on the kayak. It's been uh, it's been good. Got a stuff a four pounder and two other fish.